Tracy. Today I stand in front of you as the best version of myself. The happiest you've ever seen me and the happiest I've ever been. This is not only because of you, it's also for you. But love for us has always been fun. It's always been fun. And I promise that forever, I will make sure that love is fun and we continue to have the best time on this next adventure that we are going through. I vow to love you not only for the person who you are in front of me, but for the person that I know you are going to become. The best measurement of love is not where you're at when you're at your highest, it's but your measurement of love when things are the hardest. And I know that everything that we have been through, we can accomplish together. There's not a single thing that you and I, as a team, we can't do. I vow to love you forever, sickness and health, great, low, high, left, right, all the goods. Five years ago, my life changed forever when I walked into a restaurant and saw the cutest, the cutest, most handsome guy I'd ever seen. I didn't know it yet, but I had just met my soulmate, the love of my life, and my best friend. A year later, we began dating, and for the first time, I felt my life was complete. In the last four years, you have taught me the meaning of love and the meaning of life. I admire you every day. Your passion for life, how hard you work, and your kindness to everyone around you. The respect and love you have for your parents shows me you're gonna make the world's most amazing father. <laughs> Cause you're already such an amazing son. <laughs> you believed in me in times I haven't believed in myself. And you've motivated me to be the best person that I could ever be. You are my rock the calm to my storm, the light to my darkness, and you have changed my life. Thank you for choosing me to be your wife because marrying you is the easiest decision I have ever made. <laughs> Sorry, babe. There's more? <laughs> <laughs> I vow to love you every second of every day until all eternity. I vow to respect you as your own person and realize that your interests, desires, and needs are no less important than my own. I vow to grow with you through every stage of life, knowing that we can conquer the world. I vow to be the strongest woman, the one you deserve, be the ears when you can't hear, the voice when you can't speak, and the eyes when you can't see. I vow to, vow to be the best mother to our children and put our family first every day for the rest of my life. For richer or for poorer, in sickness and in health, you are my person and I love you. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. I now pronounce you husband and wife. My dear friends, it's my pleasure to introduce to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Tyler and Tracy Norman. So I can say hanging out with Tyler and Tracy is very, very different than hanging out with Tyler and Tracy. <laughs> they bring out different sides of each other and honestly much, much better sides of one another. And I'm looking forward to many, many more years of hanging out with Tyler and Tracy. His patience, wittiness, and calm and cool personality I knew he was the yin to her yang. <laughs> you are everything and more that I could have wanted for my best friend. You complete each other. As you sit side by side today and start your journey as husband and wife on this roller coaster of life, remember to scream for joy from the peaks, hold hands to the dips, laugh for the loops, and enjoy every twist and turn that this life has for you. 
for the ride is better when we share it together. Can I see the dreams? 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 Can I see the dreams?